everyone. Today we are joined by a star of the National Wrestling Alliance. He's been involved in wrestling for close to three decades. And he's a former NWA World Heavyweight Champion who fans can hear every week on NWA Power and oftentimes NWA USA. There we go. <laughs> I didn't have that in the notes, but I wanted to add it and I forgot to put it back in the notes. Tim Storm, sir, thank you so much for joining us for part two. I'm so excited to have you back on. Yeah, well, thank you, man. I appreciate that. It's uh, I told you this last time and I, I, I truly feel this way. I feel like this... Uh, this is a team effort. You know, I mean, we support each other because we we just we want professional wrestling to be as successful as it can be. Yeah. And, you know, that's what it's all about. Like, I know a lot of podcasts can have a bad reputation, you know, especially like the quote unquote shoot interview days, because, you know, we know what sells. Negativity sells. And sure. look, if so, if negativity is part of somebody's story, I'll never shy away from it. But the point of the story isn't to get, you know, these outlandish reactions. Just tell your story, and hopefully it's yeah. a good story. And hopefully we're sharing love for wrestling because, you know, as a fan and fans watching, that's what we're here for. And as a wrestler, most wrestlers are in it because they loved it to begin with. Absolutely. Well, and I even on that point, it's the term shoot interview, I think, has changed. Um, mm -hmm. You know, As you know, I'm a teacher, so... I'm the beginning of or the middle of my second week of summer vacation, and I find myself uh, watching a lot of uh, podcasts or uh, memory things. And anyway, I go back and watch shoot interviews from 20 years ago was we want you to say everything negative about yeah. everybody. And today, shoot interview really is any interview about wrestling. Yeah, exactly. And I think part of that is also, and you know, I can be as guilty as this as anyone. If you put shoot interview in the title, you're going to get more views. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you right. know, that's just yep. the way it is. But also, you know, you're 100% right. And I think, I don't want to say people took advantage of it, but I think a lot of the shoot interviews, A, like you said, they were people who were, you know, cashing in on negativity mm -hmm. to try to get controversy. And again, all the respect to them, if that's what they want to do, go for it. Right. But also, I think in some cases, guys wanted to drum up attention too you know like i I'm, in my opinion honky talk man was probably a great example of this where jim Cornette, you know they they knew how to get people talking and right. in some cases still do and yeah. all the power to them for doing it just try to do something a little different here I, and i support that 100 percent. i'm a very positive person so absolutely and you're a delight you know we've had only a couple people on the channel uh as multiple guests so far you know in the future we're hoping to have tyler bateman on again brian kendrick on again but sal renaro three-time guest uh captain johnny yuma two-time and now you join the category as a two-time and thank you so much for your time where can people check you out uh tim storm or t storm 01 um for instagram and tim storm for a real tim storm for twitter that's pretty much that's my whole you know, that's what I do. And I think I told you this last time is that I will most likely uh, at whatever point I'm done with wrestling, I'll probably delete social media or, or at least, you know, become inactive on it because I really don't. I want the positivity. So that's that's what I'm all about. Absolutely. And look, there's a lot of positive things that can come from social media, but we know there's a lot of negativity that can yeah, come I've, there. Well, it's it is a necessary thing for wrestling today. Yeah, um, absolutely. Yeah. You know, marketing shows, marketing yourself. And and ironically, a lot of communication uh, on bookings and those kind of things come through those messages. So a lot of positive things can. And I, I stay away from the negative personally. So that's I love that. You won't see any of my personal whatever political <laughs> or any other. You know, opinions on that, because to me, that's not my platform to do that. It's a business. It's entertainment. That's what you use it for. It's a business. And I respect that. And guys, there will be links in every video and uh in the description of each video plus at the end there's a graphic make sure to follow tim make sure to support him and make sure to support the national wrestling alliance this podcast has had a lot of national wrestling alliance stars and employees and workers on it and you know we just want to keep the business growing we want to support it and i appreciate everybody who's offered their time to the channel so make sure to show that support back to them absolutely